Jamaican born players need to get their chance. Again, infuriating, triggering. This is one of the worst comments I've ever read. What is he talking about? Might agree with you, which would obviously show that their football intelligence. Don't, is offend, not. don't offend the people, Bridget. Don't offend the people. You might call him a dunce right though. No, but Norland. Welcome on sports fans, welcome back to another episode. I'm your host Joe Mar. I'm Rush. And this is This Are That Sports TV, the place you guys come to get the best, most interesting and riveting sports topics, discussions and debates on the internet. Yes people, but before we get into the video, make sure that if you're watching this video and you're not already subscribed to our channel, hit the subscribe button. Because bro, them are watching now, but them not subscribed, but almost 70% of the viewers are subscribed to the channel. That can't look good. So why you give them some much? But you know, we're going to tell the editor for dropping in the graphic right here, now. So them can see it. Never lie yet, bro. So subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, and leave a comment. Now, bro, one of the staples on our channel, reaction videos. And the people love it. But this time, we're not reacting to no video. We're not reacting to anything on anybody else's channel. We're going to react to the comments on our videos. Some good, some bad, some indifferent. But we're going to talk about them. So here's about that. Yeah, I'm gonna switch it up a little for them. Yeah. No, I'm a lie. Let's go, bro. <laughs> so you want me to go for rock paper, sir? Right, you know what I think already. For who? Read the who first one? comment, eh? Alright, wait. Can we have my comments here? People, comments. we got you and we'll pick out some comments. You see me? Um, a, a things I want. Either address or a tackle. You get me as a rebut. Because there, there, there have been some comments that would drive me after a while. We'll yeah. finally get a video we can run some people. You yeah. get me as, as respectful as I possibly can. Alright. <laughs> you know what? You know what? Or disrespectful. You yeah, know what? Yeah, Keep yeah. watching and see. But we're going to see which one away. Comment. Go, get rid first. Yeah. So that's how I play with first. Alright, yeah. right, we could go in right. Alright, ready? Can I redeem myself in the blues? But three straight. Right? Virginia will never win one. Ready? What? A shoot or a shoot? Bro, a shoot, bro. Right. Come on. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Money! <laughs> Ready again. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You lose, Bridget. You go first. Go on first. Read the first time. Huh? Read the first time. Alright. Alright. First, no, I'm gonna give them a disclaimer and thing. People, don't right. be offended. We're having some fun. People we'll probably, be offended. We'll probably say some things. They probably exaggerate a little bit. We'll probably, you know, offend someone. But take it easy. Just fun and games. Ready? Sir, <coughs> be offended. But this one is not one that, that is going to be offensive to anyone. Let me hear it. You know, um, I'm going to try to read the name. Gigo Dane. Mm. Help me with the name pronunciation. I think I'm going to make it around the better. To be honest, this was, if not, one of my favorite or most favorite comments um, right here. You see me? Mm. So basically, he was saying that Jamar, I'm Jomar, you know, but him said Jamar. <laughs> With a comment this good, you can call me anything you want to call me, bro. Just don't call me late for my dinner. <laughs> Jamar and Rush, this is absolutely the best four hours of football analysis I have ever watched. Just could not have turned it off. Your panel was totally on point. You kept Craig Butler calm and resp respectful. Mm. That you was the live that? with Cataract and Craig Butler, right? Yeah. <coughs> And, and SG. And SG, yeah. Yeah, try a little bit. Yeah, don't leave the SG thing. You know that go. So we that talk about um a quota system with that talk about internet um the players that are based overseas coming to the national team. And that was the young baby play possibly playing play for England. England. Yeah, that was a that was a big, big line. But obviously we're gonna take the compliment. No man, it was I, 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 when I read it, I, you know, I was like, this is why we do it. You yeah. know, post it on status and yeah, post yeah. it on the grammar and all them niceness. So that's how I get um, I and, get started. And to be honest, that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to be different. We're trying to bring something where in the game already, you know? Even mm -hmm. a video like this, you know, I really see a lot of sports YouTubers that address them, them comments. So that's why I'm going to like the video. Much respect and much love. Who that? Giga Dame? Giga right. Dame? Whatever it is, what's your name? What I say? Giga Dame. DM up on the IG and tell how to pronounce the name. Go. Say, My you time. Get a I'll go in there. Bro, what's no. your first one? Narlan Dean. When I'm bridging them, by the way. Narlan Dean. Yeah. Big up yourself, Narlan. Anyways, Rush won't, Rush won't admit it, but he's a politi politician. The name can work at Joe Mar. So that was a time when we were never sure if we were going to keep this side of sports TV. Yeah. Messi is the GOAT, but I can appreciate the work CR7 has done to put himself up for a discussion. 
first of all, I think that is utterly disrespectful to Cristiano Ronaldo. To even refer to him in a manner of putting yourself in the discussion. Cristiano Ronaldo is not putting himself in no discussion. Cristiano Ronaldo is the discussion. What are you talking is about? Is the discussion what? or is in the discussion? He is. I them not challenge him. What are you talking about? <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo is the GOAT. We're not having a debate right now, people. It's one of the first videos on our channel. Go and check it out. Uh, if we had a mighty thing was always talent, we can't argue at all. That's the opinion of them. But what you have done with what you are given, I happy Christian Ronaldo. Address the comments here. As in, uh, obviously, Northern Dean is one of the very many subscribers that we have who have football knowledge and have sense. Mm. Some of them might agree with you, which would obviously show that their football intelligence. Don't, is offend, not. don't offend the people, Bridget. Don't offend the people. You might call it a dunce side. No, but Norlan <laughs> yeah. is one of the individuals who, who, who have sense and that's why he subscribed that's why he was one of our first subscribers because he obviously know the right way you see me so big up yourself Norlan and you get me I say we're not really too like the politics business Bro, right now, so. I am no politician I just know to make my case you know properly and you have some excuse about that video it wasn't in the right frame of mind whatever but it's cool in people go check out the debate <laughs> you know, yes. first debate from the channel they lose your time that's what I said Messi had a goat somewhere. you know what come on next comment all right so this is this is um Win three zero zero three four. I think that a thirty thousand and thirty four, <laughs> but when I think I'm gonna try call the number come on my way. Yeah, right, but go ahead. So this was as it re this was relating to um <coughs> the debate that we had featuring OTB, one of um our most fun videos in my opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um and the comment was that's a rubbish vindictive question. The question is Theodore Whitmore has done more harm than good to Jamaica, right? But so them said the question was vindictive, which I still don't understand how it's vindictive. Is Whitmore the best coach? No. But he's responsible for a horrible low quality league or lack of grassroots development. Can you just pick a side of third weight British men who can't make Premier League teams and expect to excel? Shortcuts and insults won't work. Bro, we are simply not good enough. That kinda trigger me. <laughs> that comment the kind of trigger because when I understand like read like read like it's a moot that we're debating for or against the moot yeah very simple Theodore more the more harm to Jamaican football and more good to Jamaican football how is the question vindictive make a point make a case that, nothing vindictive about it well I think he attempted to make his case by saying that Theodore more didn't have much to work with and he mm. did the best he could and did well based on what he had which I thoroughly disagree. Okay. He's going to say third-rate British players, mm -hmm. the likes of, I guess, Ravel Morrison and Bobby Reed. Do you know that the EFL has, like, the EFL has four competitions, mm -hmm. or three competitions, the Championship, League One, and League Two, right? Right, right, right. Premier League are separate things. Yeah. <coughs> and we have players the likes of Bobby Reed, you know, Ethan Pinnock. Ravel Morrison, Mikhail Antonio, so on and so forth, who plies their trade in the highest level of that competition. Mm -hmm. You know, we have individuals on our team who has won Players of the Month mm -hmm. in Mikhail Antonio. Yeah. We have Bobby Reed that's a pivotal part in his team winning a top 20 football league in the whole entire world, a top 15 football league in the whole entire world, mm -hmm. which is the EFL Championship. And you're going to say third rate British players? I think Tapa underperformed based on what he was given. Mm -hmm. And given? What do you mean given? Like you're the coach, you're, you're supposed to be selecting the players that you want, not accepting what you're given. And if you're given something, then leave. Obviously, somebody's dictating to you. So you're making, th making it even worse for Tapa to say that he accepted whatever they, they were giving him at the time. It doesn't make sense, bro. The, the, a part of the coach's job is to select the tools that he wants to. I'm saying. You know, do the job with. So. so then make it make sense, you know? You know, yeah, if it, let's make the analogy. If me go to the liquor store, I'm going to ask for wine, bro. I'm going to go to the cashier. I'm going to say, yo, pass me the wine over this and she take up a big bottle of and Give me more walk out the fire. <laughs> and that's my ask for you, get me? I say, give me one more. But the thing is, if you get wine, mm. right? And you use it, wash your hands, and you don't use it like drink or cook with it. Then even worse. The wine, the even one. worse. Yeah, man, so I think Tapa got good mm. quality players. Good enough. More than good enough. Should All have right. Better. So, sorry, I'm going to know. 30,034 yeah. win. Yeah. I, disagree, I disagree with everything that you say. The question being vindictive and even the point that you made. Yeah. So, let's move on. Anthony Graham, the name that kind of sound familiar. Because you have never seen Diego Maradona play. 
and I guess that's that, that's to the goat debate. Yeah. Mm. What you have to say about Mariana? Cause we talk about this off the air. Mm-hmm. You know, we mentioned some doping issues. We mentioned some other things here. If you are the goat, some I guess some things can you know tarnish your name and certain things. So I don't have much to say. I haven't seen much of Mariana, so I can't add much to the Mariana debate. But if it's a case where you doped or whatever, you can't in my goat debate. I don't care how long you do for. Mar Mar Maradona. I was it was it not doping but more drugs. Yeah, we we know that Maradona struggled with with drug abuse. Mm-hmm. But I I think that probably goes towards this case of these niggas. Why? Why? Make that case. to win two World Cups mm. with an Argentina team that oh him win one and got the finals in a one. Yeah, him him got the finals in a him got two World Cup finals and win a World Cup mm-hmm. with a, an an underwhelming team. You get me as where it was practically him alone. Um, managing to do big things domestically in a short period of time. You get me? I say statistically, I'm gonna have the, I'm gonna have a lot of stats mm-hmm. right now. But I think it's clear based on the body of work that Mar- Maradona was able to. He's in the debate, but I'm not I don't. I don't think he's in the debate. I think no, man, is the greatest. I think, think you know, ignoring everything else other than football, he's definitely in the debate for me. But I haven't seen enough to make a, an educated argument for Maradona. I mean, I'm gonna be honest, but that. Uh, I have to go watch highlight videos and old games. I just haven't watched. Next one. So, Chris Green. Mm. Chris Green said this was relating to the OTB debate again, right? Mm. You know, I, 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 I channeled these comments because I was unaware that Jamaican people are so. Hold on, I don't speak. offend my people, Bridget. <laughs> don't offend my people, Bridget. I was unaware that Jamaican people were so, can I say, ignorant. Mm. towards certain things or you know people these are my views these are not the views of this or that sports tv <laughs> let me just say that from now you know these it's a big are, team people <laughs> we can't be responsible for these views not telling me straight so go on so, these are these are joe margram's views people so don't hold the channel ransom anyways chris green said bobby and lipo otb sync them with reality exclamation mark Concord of Gold Cup is the top regional cup. Who led us to our best success there? The man himself. Tapa. Tell me, Bobby Alipo win the debate. That's the, you see why you don't try to be as respectful <laughs> as possible. I'm not going to go with it. These, the, whatever views they share, bro, I'm sharing. Whatever views you get the people, I'm sharing. Go on. Yeah. Why the comment? Yeah, so you must say, yo, OTB kill with the quote unquote reality because he's saying that. You know, Theodore Ritmore and the man, mm. the man himself, the man who brought us to two World Cup finals. Don't get me wrong. Where the comment? Where that, name? That's on it. Chris Where Green. Name? Chris Green. I think uh, I did Chris Whitmore or something. I think I probably even cousin or brother or something. Now, what are you talking about? Don't get me wrong. That's a big accomplishment. No, no man. To go to you know what? Let's talk about the debate for a little bit. Yeah. Because I went into that debate expecting more of a fight from OTB. I would say football. Affect Jamaican football. Mm-hmm. Whatever was a coaching, whatever yeah. was a playing wise. I expected OTB to come with all the top of everything we top of do for Jamaica while playing. That's what I expected. But they never they make it easy for me trying to debate his coaching career. Cause he was awful. They make it super easy. So if you were to debate say Tapa had a good impact on Jamaica or a bit more, uh, more positive imp- impact than negative on our coaching. While coaching, that is There's nonsensical. No yeah. But if you are going to go play, no man, Tapa's impact on Jamaican football One with the ball at his feet. Like, and that's what you should be arguing, not trying to tell us that Tapa is a great coach. Yeah, but so, I guess this man um, would have alluded to the fact that he didn't bring us the two goal cup finals mm. to play devil's advocate. That's not a joke accomplishment. True, true. You know, um, so you have to give him his roses there. Mm-hmm. But had those two goal cups been sandwiched by two secured World Cup qualifications, Suffice to say, top would be the greatest one, Jamaican just coach one, of all time. Just one. I think one would have, would have definitely have him up there. Imagine two, two World Cup qualifications. Just one. If Tapa had to qualify for one of the World Cups that he, that he was in charge during mm-hmm. qualification, Tapa would definitely be one of the best coaches Jamaica ever had. Yeah. If not the best, yeah. managing to bring us to finals, upon finals, and winning Nish, um, Nations League that, yeah. that other day and winning Caribbean Cup. Mm-hmm. His resume would be awesome, but mm-hmm. it's not. So we can't say if him did do it, him would have asked. He didn't do it. So he's well, not anyways, awesome. Chris Green. Uh, mm, Big up yourself, Chris Green. Man himself, tap up. Respectful. Respectfully, we disagree. There we go. My time. Go ahead. Eh? All right. Andy said, I still feel we will get there. I predict we will win four matches at home starting January and draw the next one. So we will get 13 mm. points 
and get the fourth spot. Reggae boys for life. No, put I some context to this. It did not age well. <laughs> put, like, put some context. To Obviously, I'm gonna put the comment on the screen and thing. No, we're in World Cup qualifying last year and over running over into this year. Mm-hmm. So this comment was made seven months ago. Let's say December. Yeah. You know, we had a window in January. So I guess he was predicting what would have happened for the rest of the campaign with Paul take over. Thirteen points he predicted that he would have <laughs> received from four matches. How much you get? Paul will draw one and win one. Yeah. And that is four points. So whenever you're, you're ten off the mark, my boy. Or nine off the mark. Who teach your maths, bro? Nine off the mark. <laughs> so, so, so yeah, that, um, that never aged well. No, that, that oh. comment did not age well. That comment did not age well whatsoever. But, you know, Andy, you had faith and so did we. I don't think we have faith at this point. We did call it after. Oh, it was impulsive, but we did call it after the USA game in the National State. Mm. I call it after that. I was still a bit optimistic. Yeah, we never, we never. Going into the next round, but, but by the time... And we could have, we could have. But by the sure. time the January window came around, I think it was... It was over, it was over. Match set. Your time. Yeah. So, Omari Campbell get, got a little personal with us. <laughs> well, let's talk about it. Anyone want to go Arden? You used to go Arden. You used to go Arden. <laughs> so, what's on the people? Um, me, personally, you know, bro. Go Meadowbrook High School for five years, but then not to brag or anything. You get me? I say, then we kind of we move all them to play some basketball. And I decided that I wanted to leave to be a part of a better basketball program, so I did end up going to Ireland for two years. Yeah, quick history lesson. Um, we both went to the first five years. We both did the first five years at. I did KC, he did Meadowbrook. So basically, but I did at a good school, and then him do it at a. People, if you have to say that clearly, it's not. I always tell you, bro, if you have to explain it, it's not, dude. We're not going down the road. I, I went to Kingston College, you went to Meadowbrook. But we met at Arden. And then even now, I give them the story of how oh, we become friends, bro. Because that is a different one. It's, like, it's chill, you get what I'm saying? But yeah, people, and the rest is history, man. So both of us did. You know, we, we both went to Arden. We never had sing the school song, though. Never. I feel like we would have been disrespectful to Casey. I'm mean, yeah, not going to do it. Uh, you you want to tell them the graduation story? Go on, no? So we were there at graduation, Zin. Both of us, proud, proud moment, you know, graduating from E. Arden High School. You know, two people were n- not not supposed to be there. Because yeah. we're amongst people where I get subject or okay for going to our finger. We get me and and reach a point where we're graduating from Arden High School. But since September, the first September, we meet each other. They might teach you the song whenever you're interested to learn. <laughs> you will try it. And we eventually, good at learning it because we hear it now. Some hear parts it of it. Single. You get me and say? But I remember looking at him. He was at the other side of the room during the graduation. Still looking fresh to sing the song. Look if was it was. <laughs> I rush. I rush. Look at me. And we're, we just shake our head. Nah, no, sing it, Bridget. Yeah, man. What hard and night. Left that. Splendor eater vex. Oh, it got Jerome. <laughs> the matter. <laughs> I'm sure you remember this. <laughs> right, it crossed my heart on my chest, bro. Come on. Every time. What is this career you know? It's, 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 it's just <laughs> edged in our mind. Oh, yeah, so you'll never forget that oh, as long as I live. It's impossible. So All people, right. they made a man that even know them, them school matter and why? Listen, all these football specialists and analysts, it's obvious to see to have a quota system is to never have any, I mean any progress in Jamaican football because we'll never see the ultimate Jamaican 23-man 20, squad selected. A bunch of clown. Your intentions are so clear. It's not even to expose the local talent. For, for, it's not even to expose the local talent. It's for individual and financial gain. And this is nonsense. Don't stop. Pretty soon you will disappoint many of fans. I'm tired of this stupidity. JDF. JDF. JFF. Sorry, people. That's a JJF regardless. Cha-cha. But I'm sure he meant JFF. There are still intelligent people sub- supporting the Jamaican teams. These people make me sick. But I feel like once once the, the quota system came up, everybody shut it down. And maybe maybe it was a a, a a ploy from the JFF to say put it out there and see how the fans react to it. And then they decide if you're going to go ahead with it. And Paul all this kind of going ahead with it. So I'm not a fan of it. Um, I'm pretty sure there are some people out there that like it, but I am not. I, I just believe we should call the best 23, or let's say call the best 20. And spring to some youth for a succession. Yeah, and as Mr. Real quick on this point, like this person, I mean big him up, Team Benjamins. No spot on, spot on. Straight facts. Like 
we have the ability to f- put together the outright best 20 team in CFU, mm-hmm. Caribbean football, for sure, and Easy. one of the most competitive CONCACAF 23s out there. This is true. We do have the talent at our disposal. However, because of, as he mentioned, financial greed, individual financial greed, we refuse to put the best 23 out there, and it is a disrespect to us, the people, to me and you, yeah. and you guys, the fans, you yeah. know, and we want to see the best 23 out there. So, Team Benjamin, straight facts, straight, straight facts, bro. Now, may I give my final one? You look for your final one. And we wrap it up. All right, so Z Gaming, you hear what this man say now, bro? Yeah, you. We don't need some better equipment, my G. Poor visuals and sound quality. Work on it. Great interview, still. Good luck. Now, bless up yourself. Mm-hmm. Much respect for identify that. Yeah, putting yeah. in the work. But this is what I have to say, people. I'm gonna subscribe to the channel, Bridgin. Hit the like button, Bridgin. Share the thing to five people, Bridgin. So we can get the equipment there. Watch the yeah. number, bro. Not because them see we in the studio and like them probably hear how we speak. Don't no feel like we are big still, no. Don't no feel like we think kind of shibble dung still, no. Because we think hype in the brain. No, watch your Don't number, do that people. Thing, no. I'm begging for the subscribers. Ma- Mike, no, I wait for the subscribers. Don't no feel like I'm big for anything else. One thing I'm big in this life for the subscribers, you see me? One thing. You know, it's a lie, I tell, but because it's a PG channel. Brother, I left that in the bridge, I'm telling you, I'm first to leave for you, too. <laughs> go on, Steve. I'm not worried today. Go on. So, so watch out now. I have two more comments. But yeah, uh, Kirk ENG. Did you get me? I said, let me if that um, abbreviate engine. Anyways, so how Jamaican players will progress if they don't get their chance? Picture all Jamaican born doctors being replaced, I assume that is replaced, by overseas born as well as our teachers and all. Jamaican born players need to get their chance. Again, infuriating, triggering. This is one of the worst comments I ever read. What is he talking about? What do you mean? So, people born outside of Jamaica are not Jamaican? We have a duty to develop. Jamaican inside of Jamaica, yes. But what about the Jamaicans outside of Jamaica? We don't care about them. And if somebody develops them for we, oh well, take advantage of it. Like, what are we talking about? And that analogy was so poor. That analogy is so poor because I ask you, Kirk ENG, if you have a gunshot in your stomach, do you <laughs> want a Jamaican general surgeon to operate on you or do you want the best general surgeon to operate? Regardless of where they are. Uh, where they're from bro i don't, I don't care, care. The Jamaican, you know. i want the best like i just get that just get it out of me and get me back better so yeah man, 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 i'm not so a, a terrible uh, analogy mm-mm. you get me and, and let, let's bring it let's put some context around obviously he's talking about the national team mm-hmm. and that the national team has a duty to develop the talent inside of Jamaica, yeah. and that is nonsense the national team is a reward after you're after you're developed yeah. and you have performed you get caught up to the national team. The football federation is uh, responsible for sure for development, development, and much more players, and much more. Yeah, and so on and so forth. The football federation is responsible for the local league. It's responsible for the school league. It's responsible for the national team as well as um, all all football yeah. inside of Jamaica. <laughs> the, like the federation is responsible. But the national for. program itself, Com- Paul Hall's Compete. national program, Compete. is the creme de la creme. That's where you get to after you're developed. That that program in particular should not be there to develop but we have people yeah, like this I didn't hear you still man obviously I don't hear him. yeah you have your right to your opinion um, I just think it's madness it's not a great opinion at all to put it know. in the most respectful yeah, way possible you want one more you want alright and this final comment by Alan Brahma you know for me you guys are the best independent YouTube sports broadcasters your discussions are intelligent Spoken in clear English with no monkeying around and time wasting. Wish you continued growth and success. But you have to understand something, you know, bro. I only for school fee, you pay, you know, only for school fee, you pay, you know, bro. I only for school fee, man. You see me? So much respect, though. You know, love for the love. Only for people show support and things, so I have to give thanks. Yeah, man. Big up yourself. What is it, Brahma? Yeah. Alan Brahma. Big up yourself, and Thanks for the kind words. Yeah, and in my opinion, you know, we, we decided that when we enter this platform, we wanted to articulate ourselves in a manner where we can be universally understood. You know, because we believe that, you know, we were blessed with the opportunity to be educated at a good school like Meadowbrook and uh, an average school like KC. 
and then we were able to matriculate and go to Harding, you know, and then further our studies at a, at a higher level. And because of this, it equipped us with the ability to come and to speak to you guys about what everybody loves, but in a manner that everybody, not only from Jamaica, but people from England, people from Canada, people from St. Lucia, all over the world can tune in and understand comprehensively exactly what we're trying to speak about. For sure. And, you know, we know the analytics, you know, so a, a lot of our audience is inside of Jamaica, mm -hmm. but a lot of it is outside, yeah, we do you know, all over the place. So. International. And it's going to get better. You That's say true. that it's the best on YouTube. We're not going to say it's not. Yeah, man says so. Yeah, we, we are going to continue to go up. Content going to get better. It's different from where you used to. Yeah, but I have to give thanks. Probably the best comment that we read all night. So, so some, give sometimes we, we, we see these comments and, you know, they're like, this is the reason we do it. Yeah. And we might, we might get a little one food on the side at this point. You get <laughs> we might get a little paycheck at the end of the month. But it's a big food, you know? No, man. Yeah, but yeah, it, yeah. It, it, it means nothing, you know, um, when put against a comment like this. Yeah. And that's the reason we do it. So, people, we really, really appreciate the comments. So, keep on interacting with us. Keep on commenting. Keep on challenging us. Because we do love to shut down your guys' challenges. Especially me. I enjoy it. Yeah. So people, are we that still? If you like this video, let us know. Mm -hmm. We can do more of it. Yeah. I will leave a comment. Thousands, thousands, bro. Probably thousands for sure. So, we can do it again. Let us know and, you know, share the comments that you want us to address. Because this this should be an incentive for you guys to comment now. Yeah. Because chances are we will be doing these videos more often. And if this gets um, raved, raved reviews, we will be doing this. Like, we can make this a, a series. Yeah. You but know, this are that sports TV listens. Yeah. But are we that, bro? Um, obviously, need them for subscribe, as always. Need them for like the video, leave a comment. You know, the world works. I mean, if you leave them with the mats, bro. Because if each one of you guys can share this video to at least five people, matter of fact, share it to 10. But don't stop sharing it until they get us five subscribers. Do you know how many subscribers that get us by the end of the day, bro? Mm, a lot. And bro, one, one comment to forget for read. Some people did do the mats, you know. There were a couple of people that did do the maths and I saved that I saved that comment to share, but we never share it. So people do the maths. If somebody can do the maths on the video, we have 2011 subscribers right now. Do the maths and leave it in the comment section. Easy maths, that's it. And now we are people for now. This is the side that sports TV. I'm out. <laughs>